Hey guys, Anthony here. Now that you've returned from a ride, I'd like to show you how you can review and edit your footage using the Cyclic Plus app. Okay, so now we're going to review and edit some footage. There's a couple of steps to this process which I'll run you through. You'll notice at the top of my screen that I'm connected via Bluetooth. That's highlighted by the blue bar. Uh, for this process, you will also need to establish a successful Wi-Fi connection. So to do so, what you need to do is tap the top right tile, which is review footage. Once you've tapped that tile, you'll notice that your unit will make a series of beeps. That indicates that you have initiated a Wi-Fi sequence. There are two instructions on this page, and after reading that, you will then need to tap the go to the Wi-Fi settings and the red tap at the bottom. Once in your phone's Wi-Fi settings, you will need to find your unique unit ID. Mine is here and I will tap that. This will take a few seconds to establish a connection, um, but when connected, you'll notice that there's a blue tick next to your name. I can then return to the app by tapping the top left on an iPhone. After a few seconds, a connection will be made and it will take you to the review and save section of your app. At the bottom of this screen, you'll notice a series of thumbnails. So they're all the five minute segments from my ride. What I can do is I can scroll through until I find a section that I would like to edit. I'm going to choose this one. The section of video you've selected will be highlighted with a green tick. To play this and check that it is the footage you want to review and save, simply press the play button. It'll take a few seconds to load and it will play your video in low resolution. When you're happy with the section of video you want to edit, simply press the pause button. You will notice that the red edit icon is now visible. Tap the red edit bar and it will load the next options. There is a pop-up that tells you you've captured 5 seconds before and 10 seconds after the event. That is because these flags at the bottom are set to 15 second intervals. Click the OK bar. To select the specific part of the video you'd like to capture, you can simply drag and move these flags around. I'm going to keep the 15 seconds towards the start of this video and save that. To do so, simply tap on the red save bar at the top. A 15 second clip typically takes about 2 minutes to save in high resolution. You'll notice that the clip you have just saved is now stored in your My Videos. To play this video and make sure you're happy with your edit, simply tap on the video. To play, press the play tab. You also have the option to share this video. Tap on the share link. Once you've tapped share, you'll notice a range of options. For example, I could send it to a friend in a message, I could attach it to my Facebook page, or I could save it to my camera roll. Videos that you really want to keep, it's important that you do save it to your camera roll. The reason being is, if you were to ever update your app, it may be lost from your My Videos. And most importantly, you can return to your My Videos at any time and watch yourself in action. And that's all there is to it. For more how-to videos, check out our YouTube channel or visit our website, cyclic.com. Happy writing.